check check is this thing on wow nobody waiting for me in the chat today that hits a little different well hello uh all of you uh laters um late arrivals that felt wrong uh, late arrivals and vod watchers and lurkers how we all doing today uh we have uh the gauntlet is starting again as you can tell by the thumbnail starting off with the crazy marowak yes we are back in radical red jumping between radical red and grueling gold works very well for me as we've seen in the past so let's hope today uh <laughs> does that actually go well um and according to my sheet we also don't have an encounter for lavender tower um i do want to just go ahead and check that so let's get into the game shall we here we are here's the team uh and I'll, I'll just give you my my uh baseline thoughts here for how we're gonna start today um so marowak is up first and i'm looking at a veltal here and i'm thinking that running a naughty nature with the black glasses is gonna be enough to sweep this guy um i'm running both special and physical moves here knockoff is gonna be super important uh to get rid of the thick club um, we do outspeed, uh, I believe. Hold on, let me just double check that. But I'm fairly certain we do outspeed. He's 123. We're 133 speed. Okay, so we definitely outspeed him. Massive. Um, and uh, yeah, so knockoff is going to get rid of the thick club. That's going to do like, I would imagine around 60% to it. I'm not even going to calc this. I'm just going to use my brain on this and... and really just hope it goes well i have faith in a veltal this is my favorite legendary if he can't get the job done against us roided up marowak i might have to change legendaries you know i might have to do it but i, I have all the faith in the world that miasma can get it done uh so knock off get rid of the thick club and then dark pulse will just clean it up because marowak does have a worse uh, special defense stat than he does defense. So that'll be totally fine. Uh, totally, totally fine for us. And then looking ahead into the next battle, the rival battle in uh, Sylph, our rival does have Blastoise. Ah, the worst team, the worst one. Um, okay, so now I want to check the box real quick and just see, do we have an encounter already for Sylphco? Or uh, not Sylphco, but um, Lavender Tower? or Lavender Town. Uh, if not, we can go ahead and get both of those encounters. Um, so that's a Diglett's Cave, Route 1, Route 6, and Route 7 in the box. Unfortunate, in the, in the, in the, in the naughty box, that is. Um, okay, now we have Route 24. I don't need to read these out. I mean, you guys have eyes. You can see them, right? You can see them. Wait, what? Route 25, Route 24, okay. I thought I got doubled up somehow. Okay, okay. There's this, there's the shiny Celadon, let's go. Um, looking for lavender anything. No, no lavender town encounters, it doesn't look like. Okay, that's fine. Um, we just skirted all the way around Lavender Town. I'm fine with that because that means we get the encounters now. Uh, and that is very exciting for me. Very, very exciting for me indeed. Um, I'm pretty sure nothing changes on like different levels of, uh, of Lavender Tower or Pokemon Tower rather. Um, so let's just go up here and use the Dex Nav to take a look. Um, does anything... Oh, no Pokemon can be found here. That's pretty crazy. Um, if I go up one more floor, since there are no encounters on this first floor, does it actually show me? Hold on. I've never dex nabbed in here before, I don't think. Ah, there are some... <laughs> okay, so we've got Moltres, which is basically just worse Eveltal. Um, and that's kind of... That's kind of the best encounter here, so I'm totally fine just hatching an egg in, in Pokemon Tower here and calling it an encounter, you know? I'm totally fine doing that. Um, let's see. Did, we did get eggs. Yeah, we did. Okay, great. I'm just going to grab this one right smack in the middle here. Um, and we're going to take Registeel off for the moment and get ourselves a nice encounter. All right, let's hope for big things. I'm really hoping that I can go ahead and snag myself 
uh, a magic bounce mon. That would be lovely. I would love a, a magic bounce Pokemon. Um, and I am just going to go ahead and prematurely guess that this egg is going to be from Gen 6. That is my guess. Um, and uh, we'll see. We'll see how I don't usually get these. So big encounter here popping out. What is it? What is it? Oh, big baby, big baby bear. Okay. Well, that is a very um, on the nose encounter for Lavender uh, for Pokemon Tower, huh? That is a very on the nose kind of encounter there. You love to see that. I'm actually just going to change this on my sheet to say Pokemon Tower instead of Lavender Tower uh, because that's appropriate, you know? Uh, and this is going to be our Earth. Wait. Actually, I don't know if I can do this. Is this species clause with? Ooh, is this species clause with Ursaluna Blood Moon? That wait, I need to. I need to know. Hold on, I need to look it up. Uh, the only way that I know to check this would be to uh, do it by dex number, right? That that makes the most sense. Uh, hold on, hold on, brain, come on. Work, work, Cerebi. Uh, uh, no, I'm just gonna search Cerebi uh, and Ursa Ring. Okay. Does it say it evolves into both? Using Ursa Ring, use the Peat Block, it'll evolve Full Moon into Ursa Luna. Uh, is Ursa Luna the same dex number as Blood Moon Ursa Luna? Is it the same Pokemon or are they different Pokemon? So you are number 901. Uh, and you're number 901 as well. So I actually, I actually can't accept this encounter. It is a species clause. So we have to try again. Um, we won't bother nicknaming it, but it, yeah, it's a good start. You know, that is a good start. Um, we're just going to go ahead and do this. Ty Leno, how we going? How's it going? <laughs> Welcome in. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm going to need the luck today. Uh, this is my least favorite part of the game. Uh, this is the scariest part of the game. So we're just going to release this dupe or species uh, and hatch another little egg in this place uh did i wait did i put it in my party or not i did okay great 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 hoping for big things here oh nope i'd be good thank you <laughs> don't mess with me man <laughs> you're gonna get me locked into that <laughs> i'm glad i'm glad you're having a uh, a decent day at least all right Come on. Come on. I love this Eveltal sprite, by the way. It's so good. Come on. Let's get it. Doo -da, doo -da, doo. Damn, this is a long one. Long egg. Let's go. All right. This is the Gen 6 egg, by the way. I said the first one was, and I was wrong. I couldn't see past the species clause, but this, I feel, is the Gen 6 egg. It's literally Moltres. It's literally Moltres. The opposite form of the thing that's available as a wild encounter in Pokemon Tower. That's crazy. That is insane. Somehow custom stuff be better sometimes. I mean, custom stuff is always better in my opinion. I can't think of a time when custom things are worse than the thing that they're a custom of. Does that make sense? Than the original. I guess. I don't know if original is the proper word for every case, but. Hello, baby. Go lay down. I'm, I'm working now. I'm working now. You can't wait till I start working to beg for things. No, no, no. Fire chicken! Emmy, how we doing? Welcome in. Well, oh, I didn't nickname it. I'm a fool. Um. Buttons. 
Buttons are all backwards. Why do I why do I mix these two games up? Why do I do this to myself? <laughs> Excuse me? Wait, wait. What? That what the It's too early in the stream for this. It is too early in the stream for this. Emmy, I'm sorry, you're sleepy, so am I. I just woke up from a nap, I gotta be honest. Okay, I need a second. Uh, my brain hurts me. Um, huge power chicken. <laughs> Holy sh Nikes. Uh, it's got pounce. <laughs> I don't want this bouncing on me. I gotta be honest. What the hell? That's two huge power mons now in the same run. Oh, what am I gonna name this? What the hell am I gonna name this? I kind of want to name it like. I just want to name it Protein. Like, <laughs> Boss Indominus. Oh, that's such a sick name. How are we doing? Ah, uh, yeah, this is just going to be Protein. It's a chicken. It's got huge power. There's not a better name for it. This is just Protein. <laughs> Everybody get your Protein. Holy sh... Wow. Make sure you rest well. Exactly. That is, that is the best life advice ever. I am not going to rest well uh, today. Um but him or tonight rather um but it's fine it's fine i'm gonna have a good time you know um jesus uh we gotta get this thing up to level cap absolutely Whew. playing a game you bought yesterday it arrived today what game you got a new game uh a classic game what are we what are we talking about here can't remember the last time you felt rested ah uh, that is that is that is a vibe though unfortunately that is that is a real thing but it is a vibe um yikes 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 uh none of these moves really suit the the huge power you know professor Layton versus phoenix right oh okay phoenix right wait is that a what is that why does that name sound familiar to me? I don't know. Okay. Let's see if there are any TMs that are suitable. Certainly dual wing beat would work, right? Certainly dual wing beat. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Huge power. I don't know. Don't ask. Don't ask why that, that felt right, but it did. Um, why couldn't you get feline prowess? That would have been so like, I'm not complaining about huge power. Do not get me wrong. Do not get me wrong. But if this thing could have had feline prowess instead, oh my goodness, that would have been insane. That would have been absolutely crazy. And you turns a 70 power move. That's, that's also crazy. Uh, so twin needle can go bye bye. Just switch a bug for a bug, you know, um, pluck is definitely not bad either. Um, not a lot of physical, uh, oh, I, I am, I have been proved wrong. I have definitely been proved wrong. Hold the phone. What the temper flare. I've been waiting to get a on that can use this move and boy, oh boy, have we just hit the jackpot with one. Whoa. Okay. Yes. Uh, my brain is broken. Um, always good to learn return. Um, that is definitely a possibility. Um. Oh my God. If this thing had gotten, uh, feline prowess, this would have been a double battle mon for sure. Uh, now that I'm thinking about it. I'm just going to go ahead and teach it return for now because I don't have a better idea at the moment. Uh, do I want it over pounce? I don't need pounce and U-turn. You know? All right, that's fine. Lowering the speed is not that big of a deal. I don't think we've got ways to do that outside of protein here. All right. And what is your attack stat? Okay. I mean, you're just busted. You're just... Why do you not have a nature? What? I'm throwing. 
I'm literally throwing. Um, yeah, you're just going to be, I guess, uh, speedy boy, you know? It's a good thing I'm looking. It's a good thing I'm here and looking, you know? Um, wait, they're up here. They're up here. I'm just silly. All right, there we go. We have a monster among us. I need the Among Us sound effect. I say it way too much to not have it. Oh my goodness. Um, and we're just gonna straight up go adamant with you. Straight up go adamant. Get the most out of this huge power that we can possibly get. We're gonna feed you drug berries. Um, I'm so, I'm really surprised actually that YouTube hasn't like come down uh, with the ban hammer on me for saying drug berries, you know? But hey, it hasn't happened yet. So let's hope that is still, uh, that is an acceptable thing. Hopefully the algorithm and the people at YouTube are, are good enough to know. I'm gonna use my al your alternate account. Okay. All right. I, I can, I understand that. We'll be here. We're not going anywhere. All right. So we, uh, we, uh, my brain. You know what? We get another encounter. <laughs> I'm getting greedy. <laughs> I'm getting greedy. It's fine though. It's fun. You know, sometimes greed is fun. Uh, <laughs> huge power. My goodness. Okay. Let's hope this next one, watch this next one be feline prowess. That would be hilarious. Absolutely hilarious. Uh, the safest place to do this is down here. All right. Gen six boss endo raptor. Oh, oh, boss indominus boss endo raptor. Let's go. That's sick. All right. It's wheezing. That is a wheezing. I'm not mad at wheezing. I am not mad at wheezing. Um, I wish there was a way I could change its form, but I'm not mad at wheezing. Uh, this is a definite like muck. Uh, this is a muck backup for sure. I'm gonna name you Ozone. Ozone. Okay. And what do you have for me? What do you have for me? Sandstream. Not the best in the world, but you do have multiple abilities. So let's go ahead and synchronize. Also not the best thing in the world. Gra Grass pelt. I do, I, uh, I'm not getting, wait. Jurassic world, that would be my guess. That would be my guess. Let me know if I'm correct or not. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go grass pelt just in case. Just in case we do wind up getting a way to set up grassy terrain, uh, wheezing could pop off. Wheezing could absolutely pop off. All right, but now it's time for us to pop off and uh, take on a little guy named Marowak or a little, uh, I guess it's a lady, right? If we're following the lore. If we're following the lore, which, you know, it's not a very, like, lore-friendly Pokemon, uh, but, sure. Eveltal is crazy! Felt like doing that. By the way, I've been invited on, uh, Friday to join some, uh, friends for karaoke, and I have never done karaoke before, um, and I'm a little terrified, honestly. I have sang in public. Um, but I've never, ever done karaoke, though. So. The reference to Jurassic World. Let's go. Your last name is, uh, Dutch. Okay, you can use the name of Indominus. Let's go. That's sick. That's sick. I appreciate a good, uh, cinema reference, you know? Very nice. Very nice. Well done. Actually, yeah, well done. I'm gonna use the soundboard. I'm going to use this soundboard. I paid for it, so I'm going to use it. <laughs> That's how I feel about that. Karaoke sounds fun. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it does in a way, but at the same time, it's like, I don't I don't know how it works. I don't know the whole, like, karaoke vibe. Um, so. It's just because I haven't done it before, right? It's just because I haven't done it before. Like, I was in a band in high school, and I've, I've, I've sang in front of, like, a big crowd at like a festival before so 
it's not that it's just it's just it's weird because i've never done it before um all right let's take this guy on it should be a two hit ko um that's my guess actually now that i'm in the battle i hold on Woohoo! okay so it does have 252 evs you know what i'm not i'm still i'm i'm trusting my legendary i'm not calcing it i'm not doing it uh we're gonna knock off turn one i can't catch it unfortunately it is a um it is it, it's basically the ghost marowak you can't catch this thing no bone for you oh that did big damage that did way more damage than i thought it was gonna do actually i'm here for that i am here for that all right you're out of here you're out of here dalton how are we doing welcome in welcome in welcome in we just took down the marowak <laughs> that's really good you know the legendary came through i don't have to find a new favorite legendary eveltal carried massive it only it took zero damage too that's fantastic you can't ask for a better uh a better experience there you cannot ask for a better experience uh plus also uh boss endo raptor uh even if i could catch it uh due to the rules of this uh nuzlocke it would have the same tag as our moltres so i couldn't use it as an encounter anyways been lurking for a few minutes saw that huge power moltres let's go i'm stoked about that actually huge power dual wing beat is nothing to bat an eye at <laughs> i like the the dance by the way the dancing figure that's very uh very appropriate <laughs> your real name is daniel okay just call you endo got you i'll try my best i'm really i'm really bad about reading something that's in front of me and saying something different but i'll do my best Ah, <laughs> uh, it's such a cool little sprite. I like that Pokemon so much. Unfortunately, I've had it before, and it is a little bit squishy, even fully evolved. So I, I think I do prefer the standard Noivern, even though this is a very cool, you know, ghost rock. Very, very, very neat. Um, but it is a little scary. Um, as is this guy, actually. So he can't have fighting type moves. I'm not gonna, I'm not playing around with Afro Bull here. Um, just gonna go into Revenant and smack him in the face. <laughs> Red like a book. Right on your noggin. Right on the noggin. Even though you have cushioning there. Boop. Salt took. All it took. Also, why do you know Cross Chop? I feel like that was a mistake uh, that I just never fixed. So I kind of maybe want to fix that uh, before I forget to fix that. Yeah, I definitely, you should definitely know Shadow Punch and not Cross Chop. Uh, I want you to have that stab uh, instead. And Cross Chop is, um, I don't know, not necessary, maybe is the, the best way to say it because we're cute. Okay, and now we gotta, we really gotta get ourselves into gear here and, um, and start paying a little bit of attention to this upcoming, uh, rival battle, which I am not looking forward to, because it should be the easiest of this, uh, gauntlet, you know, um, uh, but never, never really can tell. If that snubble would have lived, I would have been very, very upset. Very, very upset. I knew there was like zero chance of it. But every time I see that health bar not go down super fast like that, yeah, well, I guess it was the same speed. I don't know. Maybe my brain spring play. <laughs> Stroke. Uh, <laughs> maybe my brain is playing tricks on me. See, that went down. That went down pretty slow. That went down pretty slow for a big nose lad. Hi, how are we doing, Games Cat? How are we doing? Welcome in, welcome in. All right. 
Marowak down. Mr. Fuji saved. That is a battle that we're not touching. Morty, uh, we could consider it later on, I suppose, but I'm not touching it right now. You want a huge power ape? Everybody should want a huge power ape. It is just, it, it's, it's busted. Honestly, it is a busted, busted thing. Um, let's poke a rider and go get ourselves some lefties because we can now. Massive, by the way. Um, I don't, wait, do we have leftovers? Is that a thing? Because I know in 4.1, they give them to you at some point. I just don't think they've given them to me yet. And it does not appear to be that way. No. Okay. So we do need to uh, go and pick them up. I'm, I'm great. I mean, this has been a great first, uh, first couple of minutes of the stream. Uh, had a pretty easy day at work and I have a lot to look forward to this evening. I got a D I got D and D tonight and there's a hockey game later on. So, you know, big, big, big things happening today. Um, let's see what we missed out on. Oh, no, no, wait. Did we, you want a Shellos as a pet? A Shellos would make a good pet. Let's, let's be honest. It would. You get 10 more after you beat Safari Zone Brendan. Okay. I knew they gave them to you. I just didn't know when they gave them to you. Um, did I not talk to Mr. Fuji and get the, uh, the polka flute? Is that what happened here? That's probably what happened. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I forgot you had to talk to him. <laughs> All right. Um, and now let's go ahead and teach Evel Tall Thief like a good trainer so that we can get the maximum amount until Safari Zone Brendan. That seems to be uh, the best way to go about doing it. So let's go ahead and do it. You always name your shell as Squishy? That's a good name. I vibe with that. Abs that's a really good name. Eevee would be a better pet. Dude, Eevee would be a sick pet. Don't get me wrong. Eevee would be a great pet. How are we doing, Gadget? Welcome in. I feel like there's a lot of saliva in my mouth and it's, it's compromising my ability to say words properly. I don't know why. Um, <laughs> maybe there's more information than you guys needed. Do I not have Thief? Why is it when I watch other people stream and play this game and they go past the TM, I'm like, you dummy, it's right there. How could you miss it? And then when I stream, I, I must have gone past it or I just didn't pick it up like a, there it is. I, yeah, see, when other people stream, I catch that. I have the, I have the vision of a hawk, but when I'm streaming, I miss everything. Explain that one for me, chat. Explain that one. Actually, don't, don't, don't explain it to me. I would rather it not be explainable. Um, that would make me feel better, I think. Um. Dude, this Marnie Sprite is sick. With Eveltal following her too? That is like, I don't know. That, that might be one of the best, best following uh, Pokemon for this trainer. I think, I think that's vibey as hell. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like it's super vibey. Listen to the nice soothing tones. Don't be good. Don't be good. That would be a dagger. Okay. I'm fine. I'm fine with that. I'm a good YouTuber. Thank you so much. Um, I, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. That's, uh, that means, that means a lot to me. Um, I try my best, you know, um, uh, I never anticipated to be, uh, to be this, this, you know, active on, on the YouTube channel, if I'm being honest with you, uh, cause this started as, as just a hobby for me during COVID, um, a way for me to like, you know, keep up to practice in, in my editing and stuff like that. Um, and it's become more than I ever thought it would be. And I, I'm, I'm still tiny, but it's, it's still a massive thing for me. Give me that leftovers. Um, and, uh, I, words of encouragement and words of, uh, that, that, that makes me feel really good. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'll just, uh, I'll stop talking now because I'm bad at it apparently today. Um, but you get the point. <laughs> All right, and we got two leftovers now. That's fantastic. Okay. Ah! Oh dear. Uh. <laughs> My sprite shifted. Oh. Okay.
let's take a gander real quick at the uh we're going tiny screen guys all right make sure everything pops up the way i intend for it to it didn't it didn't okay so uh i need to go ahead and uh fix these prep documents don't i yeah there we go there they are and they're the proper size today we can even make them a little bit bigger maybe we can even make these a little bit bigger i usually go 75 but i think 80 is uh actually we probably go 90 huh can we go 90 can we go 90 chat we can looky there fancy all right now i gotta move it down because it's totally different than than grueling gold apparently we go right there and drag this boy up all right, this is the team that we're going up against. Oh my goodness. Always gets weird right after you get lefties for some reason. Really? Okay, yeah, I feel like it has happened there uh, to me before. I just, I never noticed that it was like always in that same location. Strange. Um, okay, let's do this properly. Let's go in here. Let's empty the team out and um, and and just redo it completely i think what is the other game where you just glitch out like that for no reason i'm pretty sure it's infinite fusion i don't know if that's something that they fixed by now but when i was making the uh big videos for infinite fusion i'm pretty sure that uh <laughs> that that happened a few times and absolutely uh, i thought my game was like dying um all right so <sighs> We gotta find a good answer initially for the bird. The bird is a problem. Can we one shot the bird in any way, shape, and form? Uh, the Staraptor, where where did my cow? Oh, <laughs> I put everything in a different order today and, and confused myself. Well done, me. Well done. I should know better than that, but uh, apparently not. Uh, Staraptor. All right, I really, by the way, guys, I really, really enjoy this run. So I'm going to do my best to keep it alive, which means I'm going to calc everything properly, uh, which means it's probably going to take a little bit longer to get through episodes and stuff like that and make progress. But hopefully we we survive a little longer than we normally do. Uh, that's the hope. <laughs> all I can hope for. Um, all right, so this might be a good opportunity, actually, for our Lux Ray to maybe do something or another, you know? Okay, we've got harvest, 50% chance to restore a berry. So we would run a berry with Nala, obviously, and um, let's see uh, let's see what we can make happen here in the cows, huh? Lux Ray. Now, unfortunately, we are very weak to fighting moves and he is gonna outspeed us. So I'm gonna just tentatively say that I do not have high hopes for this, um, but we'll see what we can make happen. That's, that's the best I can offer. Um, especially because we are a Luxray. Ah, I just, I, I don't know that I even want to bother calculating this because I'm looking at it right now and I'm just seeing close combat annihilate. So thanks, uh, but the dark typing really screws you over a little bit there, Nala. Um, not, not the best of news. Um, also not having a quick electric type is, is kind of crazy. Um, Hmm. Okay, so maybe maybe approaching this from the side of using a rock type move instead. Whew, pardon me. You're a new Pokemon player. You have Alpha Sapphire, Ultra Moon, and Diamond on your DS. You beat Gym 8 today on Diamond for the first time. Congratulations! Wow, new to Pokemon. You don't hear that very often. Um, but I hope you're enjoying your time in the game so far. Um, it's quite an experience. We'll just say that. Maybe Haxorus. Let's see what Haxorus does. Um, so Hax, uh, at level 56, and I'm pretty sure, uh, don't quote me on this, but I'm fairly certain that Haxorus gets, um, Dauntless Shield. Um, I'm pretty sure I get Ice Fang. I'm pretty sure I get Ice Fang. Ice Fang does not kill this thing. That's insane. I'm a Haxorus. I'm a 147 base special attack. What in the world is going on? Zaydra, what did you just, did you just broke everything. Why is your hello broken? But hey, 
How's it going, my man? Welcome in. Um, is this thing's defense is also 70? So I'm not, I'm not quite understanding how I only do 57% with... What? That doesn't make any sense to me. It makes zero sense to me. Uh... Okie dokie. Did Dauntless Shield already account for my, uh... Yeah, it did. Okay. Okay. Dauntless Shield. Uh... Let's see. Let's take a gander. Alright, so we got Return, First Impression, Dragon Claw, and Swords Dance. Um, we could just go in and Swords Dance, honestly. We could do that. Um, Swords Dance. Uh, we're not gonna use First Impression if we're gonna try to sweep here. Um, so if we go plus two attack, let's, eh, let's just make sure you can learn, uh, the move first before we get too invested here in our stratagemy. Um, la 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 la. This is not boring. Everyone is having a good time. That that melody didn't work, but I tried to save it at the last minute. It also didn't work. Uh, Rock Tomb? Okay, that's potential. Oh, wait a second. Can you get... Mm. Oh, no. Oh, no. My body has, um has just informed me, actually, that um, I need to go to the bathroom pretty badly. Uh, so I'm gonna do that real quick and then, uh, you know, give me two minutes and, uh, and, and we'll get back to prepping. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry about that, guys. It was pretty standard uh, stress pee there, you know? Pretty standard stress pee. Um, all right, let's see. Get back into this here for a second. Uh, oh, right. Uh, we're in the in the preps document. Haha, <laughs> sorry about that. We get Rock Slide. Now, we do get Rock Slide. That might be the play. It's a uh, strong attack, you know? Uh, rock. Rock slide. There we go. Um, come on, brain. Function. Function, brain. Um, rock slide does 62. Uh, if we're plus two attack, what about now? That'll do it. That'll absolutely do it. What if we are... Um, I just want to see. If we are jolly, does that still work out for us? I'm, I'm not understanding why this thing is so strong and able to survive so many things. Um, but but he, he do be living. Um, and no, we're not fans of that, you know? Uh, Rock Slide still does Oko if we are jolly. That puts our speed to 144, uh, which is definitely not a bad thing. Definitely not a bad thing. What is happening? What? Hold on one second. Why is this thing so fast? I'm not seeing how this is possible. Oh, I've got plus one in all stats still turned on. Oh my goodness, that explains a lot. 
Wow, okay, I was wondering how in the world it's living everything. That didn't make any sense to me, but... Okay, that, that that's a lot better now. That looks a lot better. Um, You'll be back later, gonna go have a bath. Oh, enjoy your bath? That sounds fantastic. I wish I had a bathtub, man. I guess I just need to go to the pool, huh? Um, okay, so Hax is probably going to be our lead. Um, at 144, we do outspeed being jolly, so that's pretty massive. Um, that's actually pretty massive. Uh, he is going to intimidate me, so I would only be plus one, unfortunately. If, unless we can speedily kind of U-turn out on him, uh, which might also be a strategy. You know, might also be a strategy, but even at plus one, we kill with rock slide. Um, and that way we don't have to take a hit. Uh, if we could slow, is there anybody who could theoretically slow U-turn out on this thing? Um, and kind of take a hit? Not really, huh? I don't really have a slow U-turner capable of taking too much of a hit from this thing. Uh, everything I have is either uh, outspeeding What if we double burb? What if we double bird? Double bird up. Um... Moltres huge power. <laughs> uh, Moltres' speed is not a hundred, I don't think. It's 90. Okay, so... I... I'm your favorite YouTuber? My heart. What the heck? Okay, well... Thank you so much. I'm 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 get learning how to get better at accepting compliments. So thank you so much. <laughs> you're 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 too kind. Absolutely too kind. Um. Wow. <sighs> okay. Brain. Focus. <laughs> the compliments. I can't. I can't. Um. Okay. So we could theoretically slow U-turn with Moltres. Um. Moltres. Adamant nature. Uh, huge power. <laughs> Just being able to say that out loud is, is amazing. A legendary of any of any ilk with uh, huge power is, is crazy. Um, all right. You turn. Oop. Dual wing beat. Okay. Wow, dual wing beats almost taking this thing out, actually. Um, if I didn't get a, an attack drop. Dang. Okay, that's crazy. Um, minus one. Because stupid, stupid, stupid intimidate. Um. Doo -doo 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 -doo. But then, slow you turning out with this thing. Is it going to U-turn on me, though? That's the question. That's the question. And then if it does, what does it go into? Um, hmm. Interesting. Interesting. It wouldn't, it wouldn't you turn out and then go into jump luff. I don't think. Uh, okay. So we gotta, we gotta, we gotta get a little bit crafty here. Don't we? We gotta get a little bit crafty, um, which I'm fine with personally. Why am I looking at the tiny screen? Why do I always do that? I always look at the tiny screen first. Um, <laughs> super weird. Uh, la 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 la. Okay. I'm struggling. I'm struggling to build an appropriate team here for some reason. I don't know why, but I am. Uh, so I think we do bring Moltres, actually. Um, and we might... Yeah, let's just lead Moltres, go into Haxorus. Um, who would be holding a berry, I think. Um, or we could just simply be holding, we could run protect. Um, so our moveset could be what? 
what does our moveset need to be? It needs to be Swords Dance, Protect, and then two attacking moves. I think those attacking moves can be um, Rock Slide and... Um, perhaps Dragon Claw? Mayhaps Dragon Claw? We don't, unfortunately, outspeed the jump bluff, though. That is the only, only dagger here. Um, and then we would need to do, like, Fire Fang, right? Um, so let's see if, if you can learn Fire Fang. If you could learn Temper Flare, that would be just sick. Um, fire Punch, unfortunately not Fire Punch. Where do I get Fire Fang as a TM? That is my question. That is my only question. Yeah, unfortunately, I do not have it. I will go ahead and teach you Protect. Um, we could potentially give you Leftovers. Um... First impression is not going to be huge here. You need U-turn as well. Oh my goodness. Okay. We'll get rid of return, I guess. Um, don't have access to much here, unfortunately. That's going to go in against the jump bluff. Uh, Jumpluff could just be Moltres, though. To be honest with you, Jumpluff could just be Moltres. Um, no, because it would be too slow. Ah! Rats! Why is prepping for this battle so annoying? That's my question. I need an answer to that one. Ugh! Maybe Wheezing? How do we feel about Wheezing? Um... Let's, let's, let's calc that, shall we? So the jump off, not having something with like, uh, a good ice type move is kind of a dagger here, to be honest with you. That's right. I said it. Um, there he is. Wheezing. If we were to go, uh, well, Crobat actually, maybe. Crobat could outspeed it. Um, and Crobat has something crazy. Has ice scales. Um, it's a physical attacker, though. Rats! Um, okay. What about Weezing? What about Weezing? Uh, level 56. Uh, if we are... Impish, perhaps? No, we wouldn't want to go Impish, would we? We'd want to be a special attacker. Um, so we would need to go the opposite of that, which I can never remember what that nature is for whatever reason, but that would be bold. Um, bold nature with, uh, grass pelt. Not that it matters. Um, let's see what moves we can get on our, our boy. We'll just test this out. Probat is, um, a good option, but I do want something that is able to live hits. Um, what does our muck have? I know it's not the fur coat muck. That was the other run. Um, this muck has stalwart, sandstream, and illuminate. Unfortunate. Um, not gonna really, not gonna really do it for me, I gotta say. Um, so we'll just go ahead and get you up to level. No. Uh, set on to level cap. Ozone. Yes, please. Thank you very much. And you have the worst moves right now that you could ever possibly have, um, ever. Uh, sludge bomb, massive, okay. Uh, and we could give ozone, uh, sludge bomb. Uh, Sludge Bomb is doing up to 81% on this guy. Um, and unfortunately, Double Edge is doing 50% to us. And he certainly outspeeds. So that is a bit of a problem. 
Um, if we could get him on the sleep powder, though, which I think is what we bait in. You got a fluffy Hisui and Gudra? Oh my goodness, that is not a bad thing. That is not a bad thing at all. Um, wow. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's, that's pretty crazy. Just watch the fire moves, but you're so specially defensive. I mean, it's, it, I, you know, just be careful with Blaine, I guess, would be the only thing I have to say about it. Um, that's kind of nuts, though. That is kind of nuts. Um, and we could just give Ozone the, uh, oh no, I don't have the safety goggles. Shh. Oh no. I need to have the safety goggles. I need to find a way to get the safety goggles. I don't have a ground type that'll follow me. You won't follow me, will you? Because you're a rascal. You're an actual rascal and you will not follow me. It's such a good mon. Hisui and Gudra is easily one of the best mons in this game. Easily one of the best mons in this game. No lie. No lie. Uh... It is a dagger. Um, Reaper U-turn might be... No. Because then he's just going to put me to sleep. Because I'm slower. Um, we can't slow U-turn on that guy. Frick, dude. Okay. Um, let's try Crobat. Let's try Crobat. Set. Uh, 56 with ice scales. Unfortunate. We go impish just to give us a little bit of defense, maybe. Uh, dual wing beat. Uh, poison fang. Poison Fang does 91%. Uh, we certainly outspeed it. No problem there. Um, we live, which is massive. Um, we could just give it a sleep powder or a sleep thing um, and be fine, I think. So I think it's Crobat. I think it's Crobat for the, the Rascal. Um, over Weezing. Okay. Making progress here. Uh, I just put you on the team to see if you would follow me and you won't. Um, and neither will Nita Queen, uh, cause she is also a rascal. Um, Volcarona, not bad for the, uh, King Gambit. We definitely want something that is a special fire type attacker. Uh, and you do serve that purpose very well. You resist almost everything. Um, Volcarona versus the King Gambit. And let's just say he has five fainted allies, um... In Gambit. Uh, with the Charmander. Uh, with five allies fainted. How much damage are you doing to me at level 56? This is something I need to know. Sucker Punch does 60.6 to 71.3%. If I go Impish. If I'm just Impish everywhere. Um, Sucker Punch still does enough. Uh, we could just simply give you... Uh, fiery Dance. Fiery Dance does a lot, man. Fiery Dance does so much. Uh, and then Quiver Dance. Obviously, if we get to plus one, we do one-shot it, but we would have to try to come in on a Sucker Punch. Um, if you get a Swords Dance up, it becomes really problematic. Luckily, we do outspeed, so the only thing you could really hit us with is the Sucker Punch. Um, so I think... It's a one shot. So if Swords Dance is up, it's a one shot. Yep, I think you're right. Let me just uh, let me just double check that. But that does seem right in my head. Yeah, absolutely. It's a one shot. Uh, so we need multiple ways to take that thing out. Unfortunately, um, that 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 is problematic. I'm not gonna lie. That is an issue. Um. What about Machamp? I know he's got the Chopper. But, again, we resist things, you know? We definitely resist things here. So even at plus two, Sucker Punch does far less to me. Iron Head does take me out. Uh, 
We do have Mock Punch. Um, and then without the Choppleberry, so we're looking at 30 to 36%. And then 60 to 73%. It doesn't quite kill. Ay -ay 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 -ay. Okay. Um, if we're adamant. And if we have... Uh, Tablets of Ruin, which... Oh, that's, that's the items. Ha ha! Tablets. Ruin. Mock Punch is doing 67 to 80%. Um. I think we have to bring Machamp? But Machamp is scary to bring, too. Um. Why is this so difficult? Uh, la 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 la. We don't have strong electric types, and that is an issue. Um, I think we have to bring Sage. I think... Do you get spore by level 56? Because if, if you do, that would be massive. Uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna tentatively build a team here, uh, and 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 hope we can come across something uh, in our mind that will help us out a little bit. Um, I'm gonna keep this keep this calc open. Oh, we don't have to worry about the Azumarill. I was looking at the wrong thing. Ha 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 ha. Um. Okay, so that I'm gonna take those grass types off then. I'm losing my mind, guys. I'm losing my mind. It's fine. Um, as long as we acknowledge it, you know. Uh, and I think maybe Ursa, uh, Ursa Luna does come for the Darmanitan, potentially. Um, actually, I'm going to calc you uh, against this uh, King Gambit, too. Uh, Ursa Luna Blood Moon, where are you? There you are. Uh, if you are modest... Uh, with what do you have? Snow warning. Blech. Snow cloak, fine. Whatever. It doesn't. It doesn't really matter. Earth power. Earth power. Do 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 do. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what it is about that jingle, but I, I seem to love it uh, for whatever reason. Um, <laughs> Earth power just takes you out, though. So that's pretty massive. And uh, you do not take me out at all with any move at level 53 with five allies fainted. So, yeah, you're definitely a bring, Ursaluna. Definitely, definitely a bring for that and for the Darm as well, I'm imagining. Uh, yep, there we go, Darm. Uh, Darm does 73% with the freaking Flame Blitz, but the Earth Power just uh, obliterates. How long is the analysis going to take? Uh, it could, it, this is the, this is my thing, unfortunately, like, I am a very slow calker in this game because I get scared, <laughs> but hopefully it'll be done pretty soon. We've got most of our team built. Um, I will say that, unfortunately, uh, th this episode is going to be a lot of calking, um, because we have some very scary battles back to back to back, um, so there's gonna be a lot of it. So if that's not your thing, I totally understand if you, uh, if you have to dip. Um, and just wait for the VOD where you can kind of skip around. That's totally fine. Um, I understand it's not for everybody, for sure. All right. So, Strahd, uh, summary, what moves do you have at the moment? You have Dual Wing Beat, Bubble, Aqua Jet, Wave Crash. What a move set. Um, what a move set. <laughs> Actually, having those moves might make Darmanitan a doable thing with Strahd. Not, not even a joke. Um... I do want to go ahead and teach Poison Fang, though. For sure. Um, we'll take that over Bubble. All right. Uh, and that should be a pretty decent move set, honestly. Uh, Ice Scales has special damage. We don't have any special attackers except for Big Blast. Um, item will just give you a... Well, we want U-Turn, too, don't we? We do want U-Turn on Crobat. Um, so we'll go ahead and get rid of, uh, oh, uh, what did I do? 
What's what's happening? Oh, I was in the Pokemon screen. That makes sense. Um, U-turn, Strahd. Uh, we'll get rid of Aqua Jet because we're super fast as is. Do you want to keep Wave Crash um, for now? Uh, la 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 la. Poison Jab on Hacks? No, we don't run Poison Jab. Did I teach you the moves yet? First impression Dragon Claw. No, I did not. Okay, very good to keep in mind that we need to do that. Um, first impression Dragon Claw. We need... What do we need? What do we need? Uh, we need... Rock Slide? Okay, we're going to go ahead and get rid of first impression for now. Um, we are going to give you... I guess leftovers? Since we're running protect. Okay. Let's go. Used to not like watching Calking uh, a while back, but now it's super cool seeing all the strategies people come with. Yep. It, it, I mean, unfortunately, it is a very, very necessary thing. Um, but like, I, I can see why people wouldn't want to watch, right? Like, even I get frustrated sometimes if people take too long doing it. Um, I, I'm guilty of that. Absolutely, I'm guilty of that. Uh, but unfortunately for this game, it is super, super necessary. Um, <laughs> and then I could actually just go timid here. Um, that way we actually outspeed the uh, King Gambit. We still Oko everything because Ursaluna is insane. Um, he's absolutely just cracked out of his mind. Uh, <laughs> This thing is crazy. Um, and nothing's going to want to switch in on it, which is the best part uh, of any of this. And I think we would give you... Hmm. I think we actually give you leftovers as well, honestly. Uh, and then teach you protect. Because if you've got leftovers, you're going to need protect just to get the most out of it, you know? Oh, if only you would learn Ice Beam! Why can't you learn Ice Beam? You're a big bear! That makes sense that you would learn Ice Beam, right? <laughs> uh, go ahead and get rid of Moonlight. I'm not clicking that in this battle, I don't think. Um, okay, so Moon Pie now holding leftovers, uh, and we will just go uh, down and attack want to make sure that we've got as much defenses as we can possibly have um so we'll just go uh timid that way we definitely outspeed king gambit wait does it matter that's my question it kind of matters it kind of matters and you're 81 yeah so we need that okay perfect um, you are black belt. You are adamant. That's perfect. Strength, knockoff, mock punch, bulk up. Uh, is there a better move that you get at this level? What did you run the calc as? What do you mean? What do you mean? Please clarify your meaning. Uh, cross chop is a big move. It's a big, big move. Um. Oh, you were talking about the bear. Yes, I was talking about the bear. Uh, that's fine, I think, because Goro, you're gonna have a very specific job here. You, you know, I think you said, uh, does the nature matter? Oh, 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 yeah, I was talking about the bear. Uh, just trying to figure out whether we needed to go up in speed to outspeed King Gambit, and we do. Um, yes, we will give up. And uh, so lead protein. Do you know U-turn? You do. U-turn, temper flare, dual wing beat, and return. Absolutely massive. Uh, and you do under speed the bird. So we just U-turn, turn one. Um, item give. We're going to give you um, just a, a good old uh, citrus berry, I imagine. There's nothing that we really have to worry about too, too much. Um, when you're going to be on the field. So I'd, 
prefer you to be as healthy as is possible. Um, although, uh, I do want to just calc while I've got Darmanitan pulled up on the screen against Moltres with huge power. I just can't get enough of saying it. Um, Google. Wing beat. Six. With a Chardy Berry. Dual Wing Beat almost takes this bloody thing out. And Rock Slide does not KO me. Um, he does outspeed me. He's going to outspeed me no matter what I do. Um, but if we need to get one big hit off on the Moltres, we can do it if we are holding the Chardy Berry. So I think I might do that. Because you also have a very specific job here. Um, you are 167 without being speed up nature, so you outspeed everything except maybe the Blastoise. And I don't think... Um, does Shell Smash raise? Happy Wednesday to you too as well. Welcome in. Welcome in. Uh, King Gambit is such a sick design. You haven't found him in like your last six runs. I've never had King Gambit in this game, I don't think. No, I definitely have not. I definitely have not had him. Um, and if... So this is uh, plus two in everything, correct? So he goes up to 210. Yeah, I'm not outspeeding anyway, so it just helps to be... Um, so if, if you're plus two special attack, do I live with ice scales? That's something worth calculating. That is definitely something worth worth calculating. Um, and you're gonna shell smash, so you're gonna be down in in uh attack or defense. All right, so there we go. Um, no, you're not holding the white herb either. Ha 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 ha. Okay, crowbat. I've never calc this much for this battle, I don't think. I think this is the much the most time I've ever spent calking for this battle. Um, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing for you guys, but it is what it is. Um, ice scales. Okay, he actually doesn't out he doesn't kill us. Even plus two special attack with the ice scales on Crobat. So Crobat's actually kind of massive here. Um actually kind of massive. Okay. Very interesting. I did not expect uh I did not expect those results. I got to be completely honest with you, but Strahd is going to pop off. Um Goro Moon Pie. Okay. We need one really really good mon to be able to eat many things, you know? Um Muck is a great special wall if we need it. Muck is also really good about dealing with um a lot of these problems. Um it is, yeah. The, I, I'm learning that the Blastoise battle is the hardest of all of these. Um, I used to not think that to be the case, but um, I think I've learned. <laughs> I think I've learned my lesson, you know? Uh, okay, defense, you're special. Yeah. Not ideal is the problem. So we're not running, we don't have really any ideal options um, for dealing with things. Uh, although. Orthworm could be big in case we run into trouble with King Gambit. Um, I want to, I, I think I might want to bring him just because he is such a physical wall. I think I want to bring him and um, just see how that pans out for us. That's kind of weird, but um, we're bringing Moo. <laughs> I love that I named him Moo, by the way. Uh... Gale wings. What a turd. <laughs> what an actual turd. We can't dig. Uh, which is kind of nuts. Uh, really, I would just want to give you something like an Akaberry. We don't want to dig on the on the Darm, though. We absolutely don't want to dig on the Darm. Don't want to dig on the Darm. <laughs> um, it was a, it was a very interesting uh, set of... Ooh, Earthquake. Let's go. And shed tail as well. This de this guy's definitely coming. What am I talking about? This guy's definitely coming. That's crazy. That's absolutely insane. Um, I think we just get rid of bulldoze. 
Um, move, relearn, shed tail. Give to me. Getting behind a sub here could be massive. Getting behind a sub here could absolutely be massive. Um, in fact... The worm wants to fly like an eagle. All right. So, is there a chance? Is there a chance? Sub? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to calc it. I'm going to calc it while I'm here. This is what I'm here for. Star Raptor. How do I have to pee again? Stress peas are a real thing, chat. I'm not I'm not going to do it. I'm going to try to hold it. I'm going to try to hold this. Um, Earthworm. Mm, blank fit. 56. Impish. We do not have Earth Eaters, so we'll just get rid of that. We'll just put damp on here so that... No, we won't. I was wrong. I lied to you. I'm sorry. I'll never forgive myself. Uh, and then if we just Shed Tail out... No, but Shed Tail would take the plus... The minus one attack. So we don't want to do that. Okay. Question answered. Asked and answered. Um, we didn't change his nature. We need to do that. Need to make him an impish boy. Impish. Absolutely. And we need to teach him a rock type move. And then I think we're ready. Then I think we are ready finally to take on this battle and stop, uh, stop fiddling around. Didn't think of a better way to say it, but we're, we're fiddling, really. Shedtail doesn't pass stat changes, does it not? I thought surely it would. Will you have damage on Moltres for, from the first slow U-turn against the Staraptor? Yes. Um, he's going to attack me somehow, and I have to imagine uh, that he would just go for something like Brave Bird. Uh, but I, I kind of am okay with that, because even if we lead with Moo, Moo's going to have to tank uh, a close combat, which is not necessarily a bad thing, because um, I'm, I'm pretty sure he could. Um but hold on I, I i just need to double check it's not that i don't trust you but um you know radical red may have changed things i don't know um shed tail uh sarah b uh switches out it doesn't say it takes stat changes so i'm actually gonna trust you on that one um I'm going to trust you on that one. Do we want to take damage with protein or do we want to just shed tail out with Moo? Ooh, it's rough. It's a hard choice. That is a hard choice. We get the plus one. Maybe we do just lead Moo. That increases our chances quite a lot of uh, being able to sweep. Potentially. Rock slide, dragon claw. If we're plus two, Dragon Claw should kill. Uh, so I actually think Earthquake suits us better with Reaper. Um, I want to run a couple of little calcs, more, more calcs. I know, I know, guys, I know. Um, Axe with Dauntless Shield, Adamant. And Dragon Claw. Er, well, we can't. Mm. Dumping tantrum. Okay. Fifty six. Last calc, I promise. Last calc. Uh. Dragon Claw does a lot. We go plus two. Dragon Claw will take you out there. Um, and the jump off. 
dragon claw does take you out there so i think we actually run earthquake on reaper or uh stomping tantrum rather uh that is the one thing i will change real quick because we do have stomping i believe i picked it up if i didn't pick it up i'll go grab it real quick um but i believe i picked it up i know this is the longest calc any of you have ever no i can't get stomping tantrum because okay Okay, 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 okay. Um, that sucks, dude. That really sucks. That ruins my sweep a little bit, I gotta be honest. Um, but it might bait. It, it's bulldoze. It's bulldoze. Bulldoze is all we got. Dang it, dude. Um, in fact, I'll go ahead and get rid of protect, because if we'll be behind a sub, uh, it, that's a little bit different. Uh, switch. We'll go you in front of protein so we can... Uh, keep protein happy and healthy and uh, full of fun. You're back. Welcome back. Okay, you haven't missed anything. Look at this derpy lad. Holy moly. What in the world am I looking at here? I got it. That is crazy. That's insane. That's actually insane. Look at this guy. Look at this. Look at this lad. Um, in fact, if I give you... Maybe I'll give you the Choppleberry, you know? Just to make sure that I can uh, get off the uh, the move. Because I'm not guaranteed to, after all. Okay, it's time. It's time. We're going back big screen. It is actually legitimately time once we pick up the key card to take on the rival. Look at this guy. This sprite is crazy. <laughs> this sprite is actually really crazy. I love it. Um, and I believe they have actually changed... The TM that's down here, I don't think it's Dragon Dance anymore. Uh, it's not. So, it's, yeah, that's Liquidation now. I have no idea. They took Dragon Dance away from us because it's too broken. All right, let's go ahead and go grab the key card. We're not going to have to battle anybody. I'm actually going to switch my lead real quick just in case. Um, don't want to get stuck out here with a very slow Mon. Uh, if someone does happen to get randomized into something very scary like this guy... Uh, getting randomized into the Ting Lu, so I'm kind of glad we did that. Um, now we can pick and choose who we go into a little bit better here. Um, and I am thinking we're just going to go into, uh, into Moon Pie here and fire off a big old Moon Blast to take out Ting Lu. There we go. Perfect. Got the card key. It's motoring time. We have a lot of battles that we have to deal with. I don't have time for a Fungus. What are you thinking? Um, that's fine. I have Ice Scales. Get wrecked, nerd. I'm going to U-turn. Um, and we're going to go into Moo. Moo is here. This guy has Destiny Bond. Be careful. Well, thank you so much uh, for informing me of that. I don't know what he just went for. Did he just go for Destiny Bond? Um, I need to switch to be certain. He went for Psychic. Okay. Got you. I, I, I couldn't tell if he went for Destiny Bond or something like Psychic, but I'm glad I switched out and uh, we negated it. So all good. All good. Got to take out this guy. Uh, the Dew Blade. Just right out. Okay. Super defensive. Not very fun for me to deal with. Going to Protein. We're Temper Flaring. <laughs> Your defense means nothing. Your defense means nothing. Hello, you. It means nothing to me. That does so much damage. It's crazy. So much damage. What a good mon. Okay, so I'm now minus one. That's a bit annoying. But we're a Haxorus. Goodbye. In the last run, I think, or the run before that, that guy definitely took out, like, my most important player. It was very sad. Very, very sad. All right, we're going to go here. We're going to switch. Moo is going into the lead. We are going to heal. Dear God, I have to stress pee again. I'm so sorry, guys. I have to do this or I'm going to wet myself. All right. So uh, two minutes, two minutes.
right sorry about that that it must just be the like two liters of water i've drank today all deciding to come out at once um i otherwise i have no explanation for that and it's something i need to get checked because that's a little scary um you're holding a black belt right now i think i am gonna go ahead and just give you a uh, citrus berry to be safe make sure that you have some healing capability if you need it uh there we go i think that's good moon pie you're holding lefties fantastic um did i teach you protect i did okay fantastic and you are not currently okay okay yeah we're, we're, yeah okay we're good we're good we're good oh wish me luck guys i'm gonna need it it's time it's time to take on the rival we have an encounter after this battle so we need to get through this we need to get through this to see if we can get our magic bounce mon all right i really hope this strategy works out i think it's a solid one um but i'm not convinced not not thoroughly anyways so we're just gonna shed tail yep he's gonna close combat that's fine we live he's gonna go minus one and now we have a big sub up big sub for reaper Valiant Shield, by the way, which is insane. Uh, I am just going to Swords Dance. We outspeed. Brave Bird, that's fine. It probably breaks the sub. It does, but it's fine. We got a free Swords Dance. And now we're going to get a free uh, Rock Slide. Plus two. You heard it here first, everybody. You heard it here first. Okay, Jump Luff is here. We do not outspeed this thing, and it's probably going to try to put us to sleep. Um, we're not behind a sub anymore. And if I go to sleep here, it's bad news bears. I think. Um, he definitely tries to sleep powder here. See, this is where I really wish I had magic bounce. Um. So in that case, I think we go back into Moo, and it does ruin the sweep, sadly. But I think it's necessary, because we cannot let, have this thing go into sleep. We cannot have this thing go into sleep. Um, yeah, I think we go back into Moo. I think we just play it safe here. Uh, and if Moo goes down, Moo goes down. Moo didn't actually go down, which is kind of nuts. Um, Moo will go down this next turn. Um... But I think I, I... Do I have to stay in and just let it happen to me? I think I do, because, like, if he's attacking, I definitely don't want to just take that. I want to free switch into Crobat. That's kind of the whole point of this. Um, and then I can't remember if I calc that or not, unfortunately. Um, yeah, so you are a huge power. I knew that already. Ha ha ha. Uh, and you, summary, 144 speed to 151. Um, so Strahd is the only thing that outspeeds. I think we've just got to say goodbye to Moo um, and take it for what it is. Although Shed Tail is a massive, massive loss. Massive, massive loss. Um, yeah, I think we have to. Unfortunately, 07s. Everybody get your 07s in the chat for our boy. He did a really good job, um, but we just couldn't have him go down to the jump luff. Just could not have it happen. Um, all right. Now, I just want to count to see Jump Luff is out here. That's fine. Um, against Crobat. I just want to see what will do more damage. Thank you, Emmy. I appreciate that. Orthworm appreciates it from beyond the grave. I promise. He really does. Uh, ice. Ice Scalus. Dual Wing Beat. And Poison Fang. Of 56 perfect dual winged beat is doing the most 43 per yeah i mean i think that definitely uh will take him out okay he does withdraw straight into supreme overlord king gambit that's actually kind of fine uh we just go into moon pie here okay knockoff does a lot uh for sure we protect Uh, and then we just go Earth Power. 
All right, King Gambit down. That is a massive threat out of the way and dealt with. Uh, this thing, oh no. I think we just go straight into Strahd here. Yeah. Okay, okay, let's go. Uh, we dual wing beat. Get as much damage as we can possibly get. Shell smash. Defense fell. Okay, Blastoise. Calking in the middle of a battle. Man, it just never ends. It never ends, huh? Minus one defense. Plus two special attack. Or level 56. Fantastic. Our pulse does a lot. Um, uh, I think we win this exchange. Maybe. Possibly. Possibly. Maybe. Um, I'm going to see how much U turn does as well, just in case we need to click it. That's not enough. Okay. Uh, so we definitely have to dual wing beat here. Water pulse. That's fine. Ish. Um, and he's going to go for the water pulse again, I would imagine. Hmm. Do we go into Reaper? No, because Reaper... Goro's the only thing with priority. Um... My champ, level 56. Adamant. Mock punch. It does 33%, maybe even not enough. Uh, Water Pulse does kill me, pretty much. 48.3% chance to just murder me outright. Uh, Blastoise has how much left? He doesn't have 33%, I don't think, actually, so that might be my play. Goro, get it done. He threw? He threw! Let's go. Goro out here with health to spare. You love to see it. Okay, this thing. Uh, what is he going to go for here? He's probably going to go for... Um, Blair Blitz, if I had to guess. Um, so we could go into Reaper here. We outspeed him. We can bulldoze. Uh, Dar, man, Itan. I love that no matter how much I calc for things, I always wind up doing more calcing inside of a battle. And I'm not a fan of it. I gotta be honest with you. Um, already lost a Mon in this battle that I did not want to lose, but gotta do what you gotta do. Um, no, we are, we are, we are, t uh, jolly. We're jolly. I'm not going to throw by Miss Cow. I'm not going to do it. Don't this. Okay. We are completely healthy, which is amazing. Uh, bulldoze. Rock slide. Okay. Rock slide does 91%. Flare Blitz actually doesn't do enough to take Reaper out with the Dauntless Shield, so we just go Reaper. A lot of damage, I'm not going to lie. That is a lot, a lot of damage. Uh, Rock Slide does a ton back, though. <sighs> not quite enough. Not quite enough to take the, the Rascal out. The Rascal lives. The Rascal lives. Unfortunate. Um... Strahd, I don't know. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, This jump fluff is always the problem, man. 
See, this is where I would need to be able to sack off uh, the Orthworm. This right here. Um, and we're at 66, so he definitely kills us. No. Double edge, yeah. Man. I don't want to lose him, but I don't want to really lose anybody else either. Um... Ruben, how we doing? No, I'm not sacking Moltres. I absolutely am not sacking Moltres. I will calc to just see if Moltres lives, but he would have to live two. So unfortunately, I think Goro has to go down. Machamp is a great Pokemon. He is our starter as well, but um, yeah, Moltres definitely can't take two double edges. Um, at least I don't think so. I'll, I'll calc to make sure um because i would never forgive myself for sacking off my starter if i could indeed take two but i've only got 90 uh 90 defense so i really really don't think so uh no i definitely don't i don't take two sadly i do not take two um so we just go into goro we sack off goro as well Can Strahd take one? Can Strahd take one? Probably not. We're specially defensive, so uh, most likely not. Adamant at 69. Nice. Uh, 39? No, we definitely don't. Probat just dies. Probat has ice scales. He has way more longevity than Goro does, sadly. Um, so we have to get rid of Goro here. I think we have to get rid of Goro here. Yeah. Oh, sevens for Goro. Hate to do it, but it had to happen. All right. Uh, and then now we just dual wing beat and we win. <sighs> Stupid rival. Stupid rival taking two of my mons. How dare you? How dare you do that to me? You took my starter from me. And it, it wasn't really hubris. It was just, uh, I, I think I could have maybe built a better team. Maybe without Machamp on it, because Machamp didn't really come in where I expected him to. But hey, that is the game. That is the game that we play. That's why we're here to play Pokemon and lose Pokemon. At least we still have massive, massive power. And by massive power, I mean two huge power mons, um, <laughs> which is kind of hard to beat, to be honest. Um, the game will find a way to do it. Uh, but I think, honestly, I think, honestly, it's not uh, going to be super easy for it. So, back to the prep screen now. We have the double battle that everybody hates. Um, Volcarona might actually be a pretty good mon for this battle. Um, Volcarona might actually be a fairly decent mon for this battle. Uh, let's let's go ahead and start start the calcing process, shall we? Um, so we'll go ahead and put in the uh, Incineroar because honestly, Incineroar poses the most threat to the boy, you know, uh, or the girl rather, the Emmy, <laughs> in fact. Um, Wait, is it Emmy in this game? I can't remember. Who is my Volcarona? It is Emmy. Yeah. Okay. We don't want to. We don't want to lose Emmy here. We want Emmy to come through in the double battle. Uh, we're we're going to try our best here. <laughs> uh, we are currently modest. Okay. Uh, with what do we have? What do we have? What do we have? What do we have? We have. I can't find Volcarona. Well baked body well-baked body so that actually could be massive against town doom as well uh fiery dance and bug buzz actually i gotta get i, I gotta get out of self code this this music is not gonna this is not this is not for a good uh calking environment mate this is intense this music is way too intense to give me a error 
uh, 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 Roxo. <laughs> I, I hope I said that the way you wanted me to say it. Thank you so much for subbing. I appreciate it. Thank you and welcome into the stream. Uh, I don't know if you've been lurking, but you know, if you have, I hope you've enjoyed up to this point. Vanillux is here uh, and I'm just going to name you uh, 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 Dairy Free, you know? We're, we're going we're going dairy free here uh do i have a wait i do yay <laughs> perfect it fits no context just choose one power outage or n uh nothing ever stays I, d I don't know what you mean by nothing ever stays but i wait power outrage what power outrage or nothing ever stays uh if, if we're talking names, I kind of like nothing ever stays. If you meant to type a power outage or some other uh, detriment, I would choose a power outage because I can always read. Um, hope that uh, hope that answered your question. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and for uh, so that for this we got wheezing. Fill out our little sheet here so I don't get confused. Saffron City is unfortunately a Vanillux, but that is a massive ice type Pokemon. Um, and ice type is never bad, but now I do have to get my ass out of this, uh, place because I am going to, uh, I'm going to go crazy if that music doesn't stop. <laughs> that music must stop. That's just insane. How could anybody be expected to function with that music going on? I'll never understand how people do it. I'll never get it. Um, where'd the Vanillax go? Wait, is it in the party? Oh, it's in the party. Ha ha ha. Okay. Um, we can go ahead and check it out. Doesn't hurt, you know? Definitely does not hurt. Sticky hold. Okay, that is that is an ability for sure. Uh, sticky. Hold them. Okay. Stick them holding. Got it. Uh, would you rather fight 10 Arceus seized Bidoofs or sized Bidoofs? Um, or 100 Bidoof sized Arceus? Are their stats the same? Because if if that's the case, I would take 10 Arceus sized Bidoofs all day long. All day long. I would just hug them to death, you know? Kill them with kindness. Um Okay, so let's do the same thing. We empty out the squad and then we build for the situation. I think that is the best move here. And honestly, I think Ursaluna, if it if it has survivability in this battle, is gonna pop off something crazy um being said uh he may throw really hard who knows <laughs> my favorite pokemon i'm gonna i'm gonna use the command uh j actually you you use the command i want to see if it works for you guys do exclamation mark favorite in chat just type exclamation point favorite and see if my uh nightbot will tell you because uh, so far up to this point, I know it works for me, but I would like it to work for you as well. And you can also do the same thing if you want to find out my favorite legendary Pokemon by typing uh, exclamation point legend. Does it work? Does it work? I need to watch. Nightbot, where are you? There it is! Yes, Mimikyu is my favorite. Fantastic. It does work. That's all I needed to know. It's all the information I needed. Well-baked body could pop off here. Um... I really wish I had like uh, Primordial C or something like that. That would be great. But unfortunately, that is not the case. Um, what was I doing? I was calking. <laughs> I was calking and I threw. Uh, <laughs> Darkest Lariat does half? No shot Darkest Lariat does half to me. That's insane. Why does it do half? That seems, that seems crazy. That seems absolutely crazy. Now, if I'm plus one in speed, I go up to 201. Oh my good golly gosh. So I can protect. I can mm, choose a number between 1 and 10. 10. Check your Mario drip on Discord. I, I can't check it right now. I'm in the middle of a, the most important calcing anything I'm going to do in this run. I cannot check it now, but I will check it later, Greninja guy. Don't you worry. Mario drip is always worth checking out. Um. Okay. Volcarona, so if we, if uh, I just play this out in my head, okay? We protect turn one. 
we uh 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 quiver dance turn two um so if we're quivered up you know plus one and then plus one to special defense as well um we do 86 percent to the incineroar um okay we don't really want to take out well yeah we do want to take out the incineroar because he damages us greatly um do we want to lead with somebody else to take him out that's the question um we could lead with muck we could lead with coughing or uh wheezing actually um to kind of tank a little bit uh could lead huge power moltres is not going to take much damage from him um but then once with that side's down if we're not set up with something to outspeed uh oh, it's rough that's a rough time that is a rough time um maybe no uh, if we have Giga Drain, wait a second. If we have Giga Drain, uh, and uh, la 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 la, the Primarina comes in. I don't think they would send it in, um, knowing that I'm set up. If this kills, um, I don't know that it kills though. That's the only thing. It does not actually kill. That's insane. Um, Scald won't kill me either, though, so I do actually live that exchange. Um, the Houndoom... Oh, nope. Houndoom? Uh, here we go. What? No. Why is it level 100? What the heck is going on here? Hold on one second. There we go. There we go. That's the proper Houndoom. You got to leave now, but wish me luck with the stream and the game. Thank you so much, uh, Aroxo. Uh, and uh, I hope to see you out at more streams in the future. Thank you so much for stopping by and thank you for subbing. Uh, your support means the world. Um, okay. So this boy is doing 48% uh, with the Sucker Punch. I am the frailest thing in the world, but I do outspeed it. And I do uh, pretty much kill it with uh, the bug buzz, the buggle buzz, um, which is great. Absolutely fantastic. You love to see it. Um, well, I don't, I don't 100% guaranteed key it, uh, KO it, but key it. <laughs> uh, what about the gold dango? If the gold dango were to come in, if the gold dango were to come in, make it rain would do absolutely zero damage to me, which is fantastic. So I'm thinking we actually, we actually uh, lead something different. And oh my goodness, it is 6:43. Um, okay, actually, uh, now that I've seen the time, um, I do actually have to wrap up stream now because I have to get ready for D and D uh, in 15 minutes, uh, and somehow find a way to eat uh, in between that. So thank you all so much for uh, coming out. Sorry for the uh, kind of uh, shortened stream. Um, but as soon as I end this stream, I am going to make an episode of Xenoverse live. Um, so you guys can watch that if you're caught up in that series. Um, and if not, you can always start watching Xenoverse if you just can't get enough of me. Uh, but until next time, guys, thank you all so much and have a great